Hey guys. Hey guys. We're the Dorkeries. We are the Dorkeries. By the way, I don't think I've done this before or not been in a while. I'm Drew. I'm Farah. There you go. Some I'm... call me Lady Dorkery. Yes, I love but that. But that's name. up to you. Uh, but a lot has changed since our last video. Oh, I have boy. a big announcement. Huge. And it is this. Like Drew this is earth shattering. No longer dominates me in Mario Kart. And his go to is no longer Shy Guy that's because. True. He was a little embarrassed about how Shy Guy was true. acting. Yeah, so I went to Yoshi. But in real news, we have three weeks to get out of this house. <laughs> and we that's sold what we're working on. <laughs> we sold our house. So we have three weeks. Actually, it's more like 19 days yeah. to get all of our stuff out of here, yeah. um, which is a lot of really fun stuff. So yeah. as I mean, we're. Like, are you kidding me? Harry Potter Protos. And Harry Potter Protos. This guy. No, <laughs> Backwards compatibles, PS3s. Oh. Oh, the Galaxy Superhero Squads, or whatever you call them. Galactic Heroes. Galactic Heroes. But they're like the same line as like Superhero Squad. So Anyways. Me Jabba no bother. Me Jabba no bother. Well, we have a lot of packing and prepping to do. And Well, it's the attic. It's like, I feel like... Tell us if you've done this before with you move too. I feel like the attic is one of the last things that you do because it's just like hidden yeah. away and it's just like, I don't know. So there's so much stuff in there, but we're going to get it done. But it's going to be fun. And over the next three weeks and after, we want to include you guys, our friends. So I hope you enjoy it. Good job and no bother. Good job and no bother. You could like lick my face like he does. Let's go. There's all kinds of stuff that I don't really know if we need, Drew, but it's kind of hard to get rid of, which I guess, I don't know. I guess that's every collector's problem. Did you see this, son? How cool is that that that's what they just announced, that the new Beetlejuice movie is named? That's pretty cool. See, that makes me not want to get rid of it even more. I know. And then, are my snakes in here? Yeah, they are. Not snakes, sandworms. Sandworms. What do you do with this? What do you do with your... Custom created sandworms. <laughs> Do they go? Do they get left behind? Do they go in the garbage? It's so sad. I don't know. Do you get rid of a plastic Anakin lightsaber because you're going to Galaxy's Edge where you can build your own very expensive lightsaber? I think that just goes in the toy box. So, like, when the kids come over and they're yeah. like, I want to play with your lightsabers. And you're like, hold on, let me get the other this one. This lightsaber costs $250. <laughs> this one costs, like, 10 Let's put that in the toy box downstairs. You got it. Okay. Freaky tiki. Funko hey, Fun, fun days. days. That's that's being kept. Yeah, we've had these since 2019. I hope to go to fun days this year. I am going to go. I feel like we should just put this with our Mario Kart. Can we just keep this in the game room with Mario Kart? Yeah, that's me. Um, that's what I've been playing with. We have a couple of boxes of costumes. I feel like if we could maybe get it just narrowed down to like one box of costumes, we could keep it in storage. Cool, cool, cool. Um, I don't think we need all of these ghosts. But this is um, Felicity's Five Nights at Freddy's thing. It looks like it's come apart a little bit, but I still don't want to get rid of it. But she gave me permission to. I don't want to get rid of it. She made this when she was like 13. I guess, I guess she made it in this house, so maybe 15. I'm trying to get it. Like, how did it come apart so bad? So this is the little claw hand. How cool is that? All right. Millennium Falcon. More Lego. It's Lego everywhere. All right, and then I want to go through the Christmas decorations and just kind of um, purge maybe a little bit. What are we doing with all of these empty boxes? Uh, some are keeping, some are chunking. No, no, chunking, recycling, because we recycle. PSA, the well, dorkeries I, recycle. Well, this one right here, I was actually talking to the son on this. Like, 
I recently sold this set, but I was thinking about taking this to our local Lego store, Brick House, because he gets these in all the time and he can probably get more money if he has the box and he can put the set in the box. Um, I'm not gonna try to sell them to him or anything, but you know, he's always been so good to us. I like to be good to him and give him some of these boxes and give, cause I don't like ever want to ship these or anything. So, and it's in really good shape. So I'll probably message him today. Pat at Brick House in Farragut, Knoxville, Tennessee. One of the best Lego store you can ever go into. Um, so, but he gets used sets all the time and I know he gets this set and he never has the box and people are gonna want this box. So I've even got this one. Ooh, this is a good one. The Ewok Village. So, I mean, this box probably, like if you found out a way to ship this, it's probably like a $30, $40 box just by itself. So maybe you can get some money out of it. Cool beans. All right, let's keep going. What is that? It is a fun day's poster from 2022, and I'm about to list. It's a blacklight poster. It's pretty cool. That's cool. Do you remember in the 90s when our whole rooms were blacklight posters? I do. People would write on your bedroom wall so it would glow in the blacklight. Is anyone else feeling a little bit overwhelmed? <laughs> no, all good. And you've also got oh my God. a little... Give me some free stuff! <laughs> I don't feel like we should keep those. No, we're not. Not pop them. Pop it! Pop it! You don't, that's not popping it. You have to make it explode. Make it explode. That legit scared me. <laughs> A lot of Funko Fun Days over the years. Hopefully more to come. Pop it. Pop it. Pop it. Pop it. Pop it. I don't know if it's going to work. Ah, wah, wah. It's the bad boy right here, 10188. What are we doing with it? Uh, this is the one I was thinking about taking a brick house. Oh, I feel but like the boy that, said no on that. Look at all that just fun goodness that it shows you. Can we? Look at all the minifigures. That's nice, that's real nice. Can we just like flatten it? Yeah. That's what we did. There's a whole stack of flat boxes over here. Like the Simpsons house. Do, 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 do. Oh, well, we were watching the uh, Back to the Future panel. Yeah. And they were talking about the Back to the Future ride at Universal. Yeah. And they're like, what replaced us? They were like, the Simpsons. And everybody goes, boo! And they booed the Simpsons. And then uh, Tom Wilson said, ah, it's not like the Simpsons are really going to last anyways. <laughs> this isn't really yes. great content. Well, either. that's because we've been doing this for multiple days now. <laughs> but goal today. Goal today. Get this room empty. Get this room empty. And the attic empty. And the attic empty. That's I our goal. Like brick. Can Is we it make brick? Our goal? Is it brick? He repeats no, everything? he repeats himself. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we can do this. We can do this. Okay. More jumping. <laughs> I think we should sell this. I'm good with it. What are we going to put it on? Facebook? Um, yeah, probably. Facebook? You think Lucy's going to be mad? No. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. I mean, you can literally, this sign you can buy anywhere. I don't think we need to like put it in storage just to have. So out of the attic, we have an entire tub filled with Comic-Con foamies. So I need to see what these are and take a vote on if we are keeping any of them. So we have two, a new series oh, from New York Times bestselling Magnus Chase and the Gods of Asgard Shield. I'm gonna say these are a go. Go with yeah. These are a go. And then we have 
Oh, this is gonna be hard for me. Choose your side, Transformers. See where the battle begin. Can I keep this? You can keep whatever you want. And then we have, oh, this was like a, from Cartoon That's Network. House, it? No, it was that Cartoon Network. Uh, Okay, KO. I don't want this. There's two of these. I don't want these. So these are the go. Oh, there's a toy in this box. I think that's Monster High. Yeah, that's Monster High. Okay, next we have, oh man. Three. Exterminate. <laughs> what are we doing with this? Uh, I don't know. Exterminate. Oh, yeah, we, we keep going back to Comic Con every year. What are you saying? We keep going back to Comic Con every year, so we're always going to be able to. I don't know. That one's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to get rid of this one either. All right, so keep the Transformers. Keep the Dalek. Keep the Dalek. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> what is that? Rugrats. It's Chuck. It's uh, Chucky from Rugrats. That's pretty cool. This one actually has the year on it. SDCC 2016. I think that's a keep. I don't know. I think it's a keep. All right. I think this one. We have three of these. Hi three. Hi three. Ninja Turtles. This, out. this one doesn't have the year on it. This is from the Marvel booth. Ooh, it's got a Comic Con logo on it. This one has the year on it. Look, it's got a, uh, what is that, right? Here. Comic Con 50th. That's pretty nice. What, do you, what say you about Even this? Comic Con 2009. And the last one, Spider Man. Put, put, put. Okay, I, I don't think I'd get rid of any of these. <laughs> Flip. That's the problem. Flip. These are really cool. They don't give out uh, swag like this anymore. Oh, Very this rarely from, do we get swag like this, this anymore. No, but no, no, no. Yeah, it is. No, no, no. Yes, it is. No, they gave that out at the theater when we saw the preview at Disney World. Mm -hmm. They used to give posters out when you would go in. What's the name of that theater? Legal. No, where you go in one, one man's dream. dream. Oh, okay. Okay, so I got rid of three, two things, three things in there, in this tub. Yeah. All right, let's keep going. More Dumbo. Okay, we just found one of my favorite ever meats at Comic Con. For Stump Town. All signed. All signed because I got to meet Colby Smolders and Jake Johnson. Jake Johnson. He's pretty dope. And that was really fun. Absolute and Carnage and Spider Man number one. That's a cool poster. But I love that doo -doo -doo, it is signed to me, which means I shall not be getting rid of it. What about that one? I think we should keep that one. Agents of shit. Don't we, do we have that uh, autographed? No? No, not that one. No, but I have Cool one. beans. What else you got? Uh, we got... No, Westworld? Westworld. From the Westworld panel. So there. put that in that tub to be sold. I don't know if you can sell these. Solely, solely. We're going to try, aren't we? We're going to try. Keep. Smash. Keep smash. I like it. So for my... <gasps> How cool is that? So we have like, should have like a whole box of Avengers costume stuff from my 30th oh my birthday party, which was Avengers themed at the movie theater. <laughs> What's that? Signed by the Goldbergs. Oh yeah, I did that. That's amazing. Yep. This is just hanging out in our attic. We should probably do some things with those things. This, this is motion picture. Is this sun? Hey, oh, that hurt. Jedi Academy, anybody? Anybody ever read the Jedi Academy through kids? Is that 
that is that a dress? I feel like that's a dress to our kids. It's not. One of the greatest cartoons of all time, Bob's Burgers. Oh, here we go. Another sign poster. Power Rangers. Go, go, Power Rangers. Ooh. Ooh. We just talked about that like a few weeks ago. Remember we talked about how at the same time they would go into morphin' time? Yeah. It's morphin' time. No sense. Oh, that's cool. Look. The Hulk smashed my watch. It's got an actual uh, Comic Con thing on it. San Diego 2018. Dang. Oh, gee. Into the Spider Verse Comic Con print. It says San Diego Comic Con 2018 on it. You got this when you went to the Hall H panel. I think I kept one of those, but I'd like to keep that one too. Can you put it on the dresser? Heat piles right here. Is anybody else annoyed by this? Because I'm not. Are we keeping that agency? Uh, that's, uh, yes. All right, here we go. Yes. Are you ready? In game. Okay, I'm From the Marvel season. booth. I feel like I could play with these way too long. Do you have that one? That one's a keeper. What else you got? Oh, right here. Hit this is my Avenger set. See that one? Uh, that SpongeBob one's really cool. Oh, here we go. Hellboy, signed by Two Payton. Is that say? I don't know who that is. Oh, that's that uh, Fabio Moon. That's the artist from uh, Umbrella Academy. And then he misspelled our son's name. He put P A Y. We've also got a Tefera from Fabio Moon. Are we making any progress? You know why no. I like you right. know why I like this one? Why do you like this one? Because that's the original name before it got changed of the movie. So there's no such thing as this SpongeBob movie, It's a Wonderful Sponge. Guys, it's a collector's item. I'm gonna make a costume change or something better. Alright, I see another autograph in here. We have Unikitty. Uh, is this the one where Tara was in there? I can't remember. I don't think she was. There's a that was a cool one. He's um, he's from all the Ninja Turtle cartoon. Eric Balza, Balza, Beta. I don't know how to say it, but he did a ton of stuff. I like all the little doodles. There's two of them. This was given out at the, this is pretty dope. This was given out at the Terminator panel. And it says collector's print. I had this, I got this from Comic Con when the kids were little. And I thought it was pretty cool. But it's a Star Wars alphabet. Let's see yeah, what they got. Kind of A. Is for Akbar. B is for Boba Fett, and C is for C three PO, and D is for droids, and E is for Ewok, and F is for fighter <laughs> jet, I guess. Greedo, Han, help me out on I. Ig. IG, Jabba, Kylo, Luke and Leia. We got this signed by, uh, there he is right there. Anybody recognize that signature? Comic book followers? That's Audi Granoff. He did all the art for the, anybody ever play the Iron Man VR game? Did that game ever I even come out? I cannot breathe with that on. Whew. Goodness gracious. I got some more autographs there. Where are you going? I'm going to go pull things from the attic. <laughs> We got Mystery Science Theater 3000. Isn't that sound by uh, Felicia Day? Felicia. Felicia Day. Felicia. I think also that's a uh, comic book artist. Day -o. 
Daylight coming. Me want to go home. Here, how about this one, Farah? Who's in this one? Anybody we know? Come, Mr. Tallyman. Bless the hearts. Yes, bless the hearts. Kristen Wiig? Kristen Wiig wasn't there, but the other dude, the, I forget his name, the dude from The Mindy Show. Is there any of those four names up there? Yeah, I'll show you. Let me see if I can find it. It's <laughs> Ike. Maya Rudolph wasn't there? Maya and Kristen did not come. Ike Baron Holt. And super nice here, guy. J Jillian Bell. Super oh, nice guy. Come. Oh, there's a gun in the floor. <laughs> it's oh, a here? Star Wars guy. Here is an underrated show. Come, Mr. Any of y'all ever watch Grimm? This was uh, actually given at the last Grimm panel at Comic Con. The entire cast is there. That's a dope. Wait, does that count? Another I've been thinking that's wrong for long. Here's Department H. Matt Kent and Charlene many? Kent. Hulk hands are in the door attic. Oh, here's a good one. Daylight come. Here's American Gods, and it's got Mr. David Mack's signature. That's pretty nice. I don't think... Is Neil Gaiman on here? I don't think so. Who is it? What is it? American Gods. I don't think Neil Gaiman's on that one. Are you sure? Yeah, I don't think he did. Think Monster he High, anyone? He was not there that year. And we got, I told you, Fabio, the artist for Umbrella Academy. Another Hellboy. Another American Gods. Another American Gods. Hand me one go. Oh, that's nice. That is real nice. All right, this needs to go in the... Go away, pile. Go away. Did you see this, Fur? Go away. Look at this Dungeons and Dragons limited print. That's cool. You want this? I actually, uh, I would never wear this, but it's not a bad look for me. <laughs> okay. Nobody else agrees, I guess. I didn't say that. I guess we're tired of. Sarah's shenanigans. I think I would like to keep this in my hats. What do you think? Should we... This is cool. Tell this me is... what pile to put this in. Keep pile or get rid this of This is pile? original concept art from Disney Infinity. Did anybody ever play Disney Infinity? That's original concept art. That's when they did that at the top that's, of the Hard Rock. That's Geonosis. They did that that's play set up. Yeah. Do you remember? That's dope. Yeah, I didn't remember that. At the top of the hard rock. Okay, hat, 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 hat. I need you to look at me. Mm. Keep or I'm gonna toss it. She and him at the Grand Old Opry. Zoe De Chanel, if you didn't know. All right, uh, let's get rid of this. Let's That's get rid of so more Funko. Ooh, can you take this? I don't want this bag, but I do want the. Umbrella Academy button off of it. I don't want this bag. Toss. I don't want this bag. Toss. My hero. Is this... Let's go through these things and see where they need to go. And we have a Bakugo Kazuki bracelet. But because I don't know how I'm supposed to say it. But we're going to get rid of those, I think. We'll keep the basket. Nice basket. Daylight coming. Me one go home. Okay. We did make a decision that this little Five Nights at Freddy's guy is going in the garbage. Because it is falling apart. And while it's a cool creation... I think it'd be better just to make a new one than to try to keep it. So that's what's happening there. Come, Mr. T I feel like I'm limboing here. This is why I'm singing this song. Here's a good one. When we 
met the entire cast of Big Bang Theory. Come, Mr. And uh, Farah made all all the guys had their beards because this was when they were filming the episode when they were in Antarctica. Antarctica. And so all of them had beards on. It was very strange. But they couldn't shave them off yet because they hadn't finished filming that episode. One of the greatest gifts Drew has ever bought for me. Here you go. I'll let you tell the story. What do you mean? I love that gift. Oh. Why is that? That's when we were dating. Oh. So. That's pretty dope. This was from the final. Well, I don't guess. I don't guess that was from the final season. But what it was is you bought me this magazine. And you had someone you bought from eBay. Somebody painted that? A painted version of that that was like this big. But it didn't last. It got damaged. But I do still have this, which is really cool. This is back from when we were dating. That's how long I've had this. This is from May 18th, 1995, which is not when we were dating. But that's pretty cool. Two things that are going to go in the garbage. Slimer that I made and Ghostbusters that I made. But again, it's really easy to remake things instead of storing them. So they're going in the garbage. Garbage. Go Joe collector case. I guess that's Drew's. That's it right there. Well, does it really maybe look like we finished, but we have emptied all of these boxes and gotten rid of that much stuff. So that's good, right? Right. And then this stuff kind of just needs to be organized. So we're almost done with the attic. And the attic's mostly clean. Just so got to take the shelves apart, stack some boxes, but I think we did good. I think we did good too. Yeah. So. You know what? Here's what I would want. Follow me. <laughs> Here's how I would end the day. With a nice drink from the She's sink. She's like, you, wait, what are you doing? Listen, <laughs> I know this isn't usually the view of the end of a dorkery video, but... In the meantime... Go dork yourself. Pew, pew! <laughs>